Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X! Last time we got here to Mount Gagazette. We actually did a lot in last episode now that I realize it. We got a freaking new Aeon, and then we came over here to Mount Gagazette, and we defeated Baran and Yankee with Kimari by himself. Did quite a bit of stuff. One thing about Kimari real quick, is I'm pretty sure I have all of his overdrives now, yep. Except for the last one, which we won't be able to get till later. I think it's an actually a bonus dungeon, so... Or at least, it, I won't call it a bonus dungeon, but it's in a dungeon that you can't get to until after you get to the end of the Xanarkin and stuff. So anyway, I'm going to worry about it. Off through Mount Gagazette we go today. Time to run into a lot of new monsters. Hey, it's going to take us more than one episode across this place. I can already tell you that right now. But, for now, let's just do our thing. Cross the borders. And oh, oh, you know. oh, Veron, what's up? I thought we already dealt with you. What is it this time? Yeah, really, though. Writing these lyrics down, I never knew the lyrics. thought that the Ronso could carry such a tune. They can all sing. Every last one of them. You gonna join in with them, Kamari? trying to send us off on a good note. I mean, they know that Yuna's about to go to her doom. We know that Yuna's about to go to her doom. I mean, we're still going to try and find a way to save her, but in the meantime, at least we could do send her off well. Alright. So, our first look at new enemies that aren't really new at all. They're just more of these fuckers. Steel. Alright, so, as I've already shown, we are going backwards on Titus's. um, on Titus' spear grid right now, so I'm actually going to make sure he gets a bunch of turns because I need him to do his thing. I'm actually not going to let him do a turn there. I want to make sure Kimari keeps getting turns as well. I hope you fight more of these guys. Free all bed potions. Easy win. Kimari gets to be in the battle every time. We're not going to get overkills, though. That's the only problem. Anyway, along this path, you'll see a lot of these little fucking... First, let's fight a new battle with more monsters. What do you say? Or, a, a, my bad, another battle with new monsters is what I tried to say. Start with Waka. Still got my capture weapons on, so let's just stick to capturing everything we see. Imps, we saw those in the uh, Cave of Stolen Faith. We'll also see them here. I'm not sure which place they count for. It doesn't really matter. If we don't have ten of them yet, it doesn't matter where they count for. We're going to catch ten of them. Anyway, these are our alternate bombs. These are grenades. They're just black bombs. They're just annoying as fuck, just like bombs are. Lucky for us, we kick ass and take names now, so it doesn't matter. Also, I'm going to make sure Kimari gets turns. Always make sure Kimari Ronso gets turns. Make sure he turns some tricks. We should be getting a level 4 key sphere on this mountain somewhere, which is good because, like I said, I'm waiting for one so we can actually move Arn along his sphere grid again. I want to grab zombie break, I think it is. Zombie break? The zombie attack? I don't remember. Anyway, you can check out these things when you're walking around the mountain. These are like little checkpoints. Sort of. These mark the graves of summoners and guardians who failed. That's what they submark. I was gonna. I was waiting until they explained it. <laughs> So, yeah. You can see how many summoners have failed along Mount Gagazette as you go along this place. There's your first first uh, marker. We'll see how many more of those we come across. See how many summoners who've died on Mount Gagazette. Maybe more than you think, but we'll see. Anyway, let's just steal from a bunch of Albed bitches, bitches, bitches. I'm going to let Yuna be my third stealer right now. I know Riku usually is, but the thing about Riku is her sphere grid is a little bit boring. 
meaning I don't really have anything left I want to learn on her sphere grid that I care about, and therefore if she falls behind, I'm not going to be too sad about it. And nobody's going to fall behind that hard when they're just stealing anyways, they're not getting overkills. Only overkills will make people go sphere grid levels super fast, which we're not doing when we're stealing anyways. Alright, oh look, new enemies, Some more of these fuckers. We're just going to get mostly pallet swaps on this mountain, we're not going to get anything unique, I don't think. I don't think. Then we in the next battle watch, we'll get something unique. Fucking A, man. Can we get a turn up in this, or what? Can we get a turn up in this, or what? Um, come on, bomb. Go ahead and grow. Do your growy ass thing. I'm gonna let Waka get up in here real quick and see if we can get rid of this grenade first. See ya! Granada. Seed burst. Seed burst is such a weird ability. Oh, when it confuses us, ah, ah, hey, confuse. One of the most annoying fucking status effects ever. Got both of them too. Kimari didn't take a turn, right? Let's make sure he takes a turn. Three remedies. Cool. Yeah. Oh my. Did you have to crit hit yourself, Waka? Seriously? You fucking idiot. At least they unconfused Titus. That's good. Seriously, that was dumb. Titus, can you kill these guys? Not in one hit, as I had hoped. I guess this is turning into a more of a real battle than I really wanted it to be, but that's alright, I guess. Waka, wake your bitch ass up, son. Knocking yourself out and shit. Get rid of this guy. See ya. No overkill, huh? Oh, those are called Grats? Oh. I didn't think Grats showed up in any other Final Fantasy disease except for 8. Not that they look any different, or look like the grass from Final Fantasy VIII, which were also plants. They just didn't look like this. They look like... I don't even know how to describe them. They didn't look like this. That's the best description I can give. So be it. So be it. I guess I'm just getting people turns now at this point. Lulu's the only odd girl out at this point. Um, actually, you know what? Let's get Lulu in this. We'll let Lulu get the finishing blow here. Burn them down, baby. Burn them down. Bo, burn them down. Yeah, buddy. We're not going to get much overkills here, by the way. As much as we would like to, we're not. I should have captured him. I just realized that. Why didn't I capture him? That was dumb. That was dumb. It's all right. Capturing them is not the top priority at the moment, though it is nice. Let's get rid of this dog and capture Bandersnatch. Plus the overkill is good. Lulu, and we'll ensure you get a turn by letting you defend. Nidhogg, farewell. Um, the machine bitch, let's let Kimari deal with him. Kimari, steal from that bitch. See ya. <sighs> Do we have 99 grenades yet? Because seriously, we have must have a lot of them since we've stolen from like every single one of those Albed machines we've come across. Wait, there's a path over here. There is. There's a little side path. Make sure you don't miss any side paths here. There are a bunch of them. Hey, look, this battle again. This fucking mountain is going to make me want to freaking cut battles out so hard. Fuck this mountain so hard. The enemies here are where we're going to start getting really annoyed by how long it takes to kill them. It really is. It's just something that we got to deal with, though. Huh. <sighs> It is the way it is, and that's the way it's gonna be. That's just the way it is. You'll never get any changes. Oh, come on. I must already stole from him. I wasn't paying attention. Waka, your turn. Newsflash, your side lost. Don't seed burst. No. Waka seed burst. Ah. See first. Hate it so much. Kill him. Thank you. Alright, who needs a turn? Who needs a turn? Let's get Yuna in this bitch. I'll let her do some stealing. Why not? Yoink. Thanks for the fire, Jim Jaroski. Die. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Grenade, bam. You're gonna die. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Grenade, you're gonna die. Alright, let's get him with Auron. Auron, we will capture you with Auron. Farewell. Farewell, Gay Bowser. 
Orin got Victor. Hey. Orin rolling in the overdrive modes. Let's go ahead and do our sphere levels now. Except for Orin, of course. Uh, I know we only have one, but better to stay on top of it with only one than to let it build up too high and have to do a million at once. Tomorrow with more speed is good. Uh, Yuna with more magic defense. That was going to be magic. Oh, shit, son. You know what I forgot to do? We're going to do it right now because I'm thinking about it and we're in the sphere grid right now. I'm going to do it in just a sec. Give me one mom. More magic D. Waka. More HP. Sounds good. All right. Yuna. This is something I meant to do a couple episodes ago, but I completely forgot. Yuna. Black magic spheres. Something I'm just going to do, and then I'll tell you why in a moment. Um, yeah, we're going to learn the Aga spells. Fiaraga. Uh, whatever this one is. The middle. No. What? Hold on. Oh, we have to use it again. Sorry. Um, where's it at? Give me, give me over there. Here we go. Thundaga. And, of course, let's not forget about Blizzaga. Now, I could learn Waterga also. I'm going to contemplate that, though, because I don't think there's very many enemies left in the game who are weak to Waterga. Um, I actually didn't know that, but thanks to H.C. Bailey, he recommended that that was a thing, since there's not very many enemies left who are weak to it. Um, but the reason why I let Yuna learn Black Magic, check this shit out. Her magic is 48, right? Who's our Black Mage? Well, Kimari's one of them. He only has 40. And check out Lulu. Only 40 as well. Combined, they only have 40. Or, you know, 40 each. Make sure you don't miss this path, because check it out. It's a Broska Sphere, which counts as part of the Jex Sphere side quest. So make sure you pick it up. We've had an Orange Sphere, and we've had a bunch of Jex Spheres. I think this is our first Broska Sphere, though. Hello, Yuna. I hope you are well. How did you know Yuna would pick this up? Wonder how old you are now that you're watching this sphere. You must be very beautiful, like your mother. Damn right she's beautiful. I wish I could see you. Oh, by the way, Jack and Oren send their regards. So far, our journey has been very entertaining. Of course, it is a hard journey, but I have no regrets. It is the path I have chosen. Yuna, when you have grown, you will have to find your own path. Do what you must do the way you want to do it. Doors will always open themselves to those who do. Listen close, Yuna. Your future is yours to make. Live the way you want to. Whatever way that may be, you have your father's full support. Yuna, I will always be with you. That's a nice little farewell from her dad. That's pretty cool. Anyway, Auron learned his overdrive tornado, so I believe that means we got all of the Jack Spheres? Really? I thought there was one other one. Well, we must have, because we got we got the achievement for having all the Jack Spheres, so there you go. I was thinking there was one more. But I guess not. So we got we already got Auron's final limit break? Jesus. How early is that? I didn't expect that. Well, early. Define early. It's not like the end of the game isn't too far away. Xanarkin, I mean, potentially the end of the story isn't Xanarkin. I mean, we don't know that for a fact yet, but that's what we know. That's what we think. That's what we think we know. The end of the road is Xanarkin. I can just say that much. But when the road ends, does that mean our journey is over? Well, that's... That's, uh... That's something we'll find out soon enough, viewers. Soon enough. I, st I can't believe how far we are into this game already. I mean, I say already. We are already in the episode, the 40s of episodes, so it's not like already is a thing, but... I just say that because not that... It seems like not that much time has passed since I started this Let's Play and we're already as far into the game. I I'm, I'm glad we are, though. I... I I don't want to drag out a game that I like like this too hard, especially when I've played it before. It's hard to drag out games that I've played before. It's like, man, I wish I was almost done with it already so we could do another one. I'm not saying I'm sick of this game yet. I'm actually rather enjoying my playthrough of this very much so. So much that I like to record more than one episode at a time a lot because that lets me 
I don't know, I just don't want to take a break. I, it's been so long since I played this game, especially all the way through, that I, I just want to play it. I have very high desires to play and keep playing once I start playing. Hard times taking a break and not recording it, you know what I mean? Because the thing is, when I do take a break of recording this, I usually take like a whole week off, and then when I jump back into it, I record a whole bunch. That's kind of how I've been doing it. I don't record them like six in one day or anything like that, but you know, in the, in, over the course of three days, I might record like six episodes. Not much has changed. In a little bit of insights into how Funky G's been doing these let's this let's play specifically. Um, yeah. Let's get rid of these grats. So they don't confuse us with their bratty ass bullshit. And it's our first look at another one of these big Yeti motherfuckers. They're strong, so be careful. This is a Bashura. He basically means he's garbage. He's a garbage bag of Bashura. Alright, now that we got rid of the stupid plants, let's wake him up. Yo, Wacka. Wake your bitch ass up. Take a nap and shit. You take a nap in the cold, you might freeze to death. You know what I'm saying? That's usually how it works, man. You know what I'm saying? Not me. Uh, Aaron, finish him. I don't know how much HP this guy has. He has a lot. 17,000. All right. Well, in that case, let's get everybody a turn up in here. Battle's going to take a while. Might as well let everybody get a turn. Waka. Did Kimari get a turn? I don't think Kimari got a turn. I don't think Kimari fought in this one. So let's steal again. I guess I could have just physical attacked or used magic or something. Um, did Yuna get a turn? No. Wait, yes, she did. She healed Waka. What am I saying? Lulu did not get a turn. I'm assuming he had a weakness of fire, like most things. I don't know. If he doesn't have a weakness of fire, at least it'll hurt him, right? Yeah. 5,000? Very good. Very good. Oh, shit. Pissed him off. He's psyched up now. My bad. I didn't mean to piss you off, sir. I'm sorry. Let me get Titus back up in here. Make sure we capture this fool. Anything that has a lot of HP like this, make sure you capture them every time you see them so you don't have to do it again later. Got him. Basura! You have been cut. Nice little rotation of characters. Everybody got a turn, and we had a victory. Nice work, guys. Nice freaking work. All right, Yuna, do your thing. Cure everybody up. Just cure everybody all the way. She's got enough MP. I'm not even gonna use her MP through here anyways, even though she does have black magic now. All right, steal some more bitches. Steal some more bitches. Steal some more bitches. Ha! Ha! Oh, ha. How many more imps do I need to catch? I don't think I ran into very many, many of them in the, that stolen faith cave. So One of the few enemies I didn't run into a million times. And they only come one at a time, so can't capture like three at once. Capture that grenade. Probably almost done capturing ten grenades, too. Which means I don't have to worry about capturing them after I get ten of them. Probably still gonna end up capturing some just because of my physical attackers, but I won't be focused on catching them only. Also, we gotta use Titus' limit break. We've been saving it for too long. Too, too long. Anyway, here's another dead point, or no, another dead person. Summoners that die appear aren't sent to the far plane. Why not? Who would send them? They die alone. This is very true. So that means... Many have become fiends, and they may want Yuna's company. Dun dun well, dun. Yuna will be fine. You're right. You're damn right Yuna will be fine. There's plenty of us to fucking make sure she don't die. Anyway, there's a lot of freaking treasure chests in this place, and I'm, I'm just quickly glancing over my notes during that conversation, and I'm realizing, I think I missed a treasure chest or two earlier. Neither of which was make or break. Like, they weren't amazing things. I missed some money and some mega potions. Because so I don't think I got any treasure chests before I got to the Broska Sphere, I'm pretty sure. So that definitely means I missed some, missed some treasures. Um, I may go back for those. Maybe later. I'm not, I, neither of them do I need now. So I'm not in that big of a hurry. And I don't think there's an achievement for grabbing every treasure chest in the game. Because if there was, I would have already fucked that one up. Um, needless to say, let's go this way first. Wait, do we want to go this way first? Sorry. Hold on. Um. Wait, no. I think we actually want to go up this way first. I think that going back across that, uh, going across that path we're about to go will actually wind us around the way we need to go. So, um, yeah. 
place is a very confusing path, easy to miss treasures and whatnot. The only thing you want to make sure you don't miss is that Broska Sphere, which I didn't, so that's the only concern I, w I had originally. I also want to make sure I don't miss the level 4 key sphere, but I know exactly what part of this place that is in, so I'm not concerned about that. <sighs> anyway, let's just concern ourselves with the battle at hand. How many more of these grenades do we need to catch? This actually might be the last two we need. I know we've at least fought eight of these already. We've had to. This might actually be... I might actually already have ten. We'll see. We're going to try and capture this one, and then we'll see. Hurry up with your magic bullshit. You're not going to kill me, bro. Well, we captured it, so that's not ten yet. Anyway, whatever. Just keep capturing bitches till you can't capture them no more. As long as we get overkills when we can, it's all worth it. You're damn right it is. You're damn right. Yep, this is the right way. You can tell by the path having an end over here that we're going the right way. There's a treasure chest. And another one of these battles. God, it's frustrating. Alright, another imp for me. Yay. Hurry up and grow, you grenade. God, why can't you grow faster? Grow faster, grenade. Grow faster. And we'll let Titus capture this one. Alright, looks like we caught all the grenades we need. This is good. This is good. Alright, in that case, let's just use magic on their asses. Let's watch Yuna rain down upon these bitches with some blizzard. Rain down upon you with Blizzard. Actually, that did not do anywhere near as much damage as I would hope it would have done. That's actually quite disappointing. Yeah, it should do damage. What the hell? I mean, it did not, it's not like it didn't do damage, but it didn't do as much damage as I wanted it to. I mean, how much damage is how much I wanted it to do? I don't know. A decent amount? Whatever. Screw you too, game. I'll just go ahead and let Riku steal from the guy because I ain't got nothing better to do. And then I'll let Walker kill him because whatever. Whatever. Can't get overkill on that asshole right now anyways. I don't even care. I don't even care. Just give him my treasure chest. Yay, defending bracer. Actually, is that it? Is that a good bracer? Stone proof, poison proof. Not bad, not bad at all. I have a lot of things in here, by the way. I haven't really bothered to look at all these things I've been getting from random battles. All of my spoils. Alright, we don't need any more grenades. We probably still need to catch some more of these fucking plant fuckers. So we'll have to do that. And we will catch the Grats. Congrats, Grats. You will be catched. Actually, let's get Kimari out here. I want Kimari to get all the turns. All the turns, Kimari. Every turn and all the turns. Congrats, you Grats. You fall before me. And as for this fucking Granada, fuck them. As you wish. Enough. Enough, bitch. Right. I think Lulu's the only one getting left out of these battles right now. Everybody else seems to be getting a turn. I didn't use Yuna in that one either. But Yuna's been getting in most of these. Trying to make sure I use almost everyone. I really don't want anyone to get super left behind. Um, steal from these guys. So many antidotes. Nice one hit kill. I love it. I love it, Titus. You the man, bro. You the man. Alright, let's get Kimari in this bitch. Steal from this motherfucker. Yeah. Man, didn't they give me some better items earlier? Now they're only giving me antidotes. Oh, man. Not supposed to use Psych Up right now, homie. Um, Riku. Her steal. 
And then we'll get an uh, attack in here. And then we'll get a unibrow up in this. Now, are they weak to any elements? They are weak to fire, as I predicted they would be. Burn them! Burn him and his crispy ass blue hair. Diem. A Diem, you man. A Diem. Waka, I don't know if you got a turn yet, but let's go ahead and get you one. Probably gonna finish this guy with physical attacks. Yep. Overkill with the 9,000. You are the man, Titus. Over 9,000 with the crit hit. I love it. Oh, yes. We're getting lots of spear levels. Lots and lots of spear levels. I have to utilize those. I'm about to just capture the imp and then run from this battle. In fact, I think that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Capture the imp. And then run. Because I don't want to kill those bombs. Grenade the bomb grenades. I just don't. You can't make me. Wait, when you kill something and flee, you still get the experience for it? That is actually pretty awesome. I didn't know that. I really didn't know that. Hey look, it's that guy. I don't know why I said that guy. We don't know that guy. Who is that guy? I just didn't get a chance to say hi because fucking shit happened, you know? Make sure we catch early grats. I don't know how many more we need, but it's got to be close to 10 now. Uh huh. Well, congrats. No more seed cannon. I hate it. Okay, he missed. Actually, that wasn't the move I was worried about. It's seed. Bullet seed or whatever the fuck it's called is the one I don't want to see. All right, no more grats. Cool. In that case, let's get the fuck out of here. I won't fight any more battles of guys I don't need to capture. That's what that'll be my rule of thumb now. If I've already captured ten of them, I'm not fighting them. Hey, you. What are you? What are who are? What are you? Greetings, Lady Yuna. My name is Wants. Hi, Wants. We have met several times before, right? Have we? Not running today. Hmm. I have to carry on my brother's oh. business. You've met him, I think. Owaka the twenty-third. Hey. Merchant extraordinaire. Hey, what's up, bro? Wait, you're that guy's brother? Hmm. My brother wanted to come help Lady Yuna. But the temple imprisoned him for helping traitors. Garbage. They imprisoned him because of us? He doesn't regret it, though. In fact, he told me before they took him. Don't worry about me. Just go help Lady Yuna. But well, that's very why noble would of your him. brother do this for us? Well... Hey, this isn't the time for talking. There's dealing to be done. Welcome to Owaka's. Alright, what you got for sale, bruh? Probably got some good stuff. He's got Fire Eye Strike. That sounds decent. I'm actually tempted on that one just because I want to have one that has a bunch of elements on it. Um, let's see. Conductor. That sounds pretty good, actually. I like that it has initiative and three empty slots. That's amazing. So expensive, though double penalty. There's some good stuff here, by the way. Some very, very good stuff. But I think the thing I want to buy from him, I don't have enough money for, which is this. I really, really, really want this. Like, really bad. I'm missing, I'm short by like 20,000 gil, or like 14,000 gil. What do I have to sell? I know I got stuff to sell. What do we have to sell? Let's go ahead and sell that. And the broke sword with plus 5 with Empty slot sounds good. I'm gonna sell. What am I gonna sell? I don't really wanna sell too many of these things. Uh, magic counter? I'll hold on to that, I guess. I don't know what I wanna sell. I can get rid of this. And this. Glorious shield. Uh, I like that one a lot. I wanna hold on to that one. You know what? I'm gonna get rid of this one. All the money I can get right now is what I want to do, so I'm trying to get as much money as I can. I'm just going to sell stuff I know I won't use. I might use that. Probably won't use this. The silence proof. Probably won't, so I'm just going to get rid of it. Um, Kotetsu. I like that it has counterattack, but I feel like I probably won't use this, like, ever. Let's just get rid of it. I probably just won't use it. That's the thing. I'll get you one of those. Probably won't use the sleep touch one. Um, 
probably not going to use these bracers anymore that give you elemental guards. I know I held on to the other ones earlier, but I'm really thinking about it now. SOS Reflect. Not a great ability. Probably going to go ahead and sell that as well. I'd rather not use one that has that as its main ability. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and get rid of this. And I think I'll go ahead and get rid of the Serene Bracer as well. I'm trying to make sure I get enough money here, if you couldn't tell, so I'm, that's why I'm selling like everything right now. Um, I'm probably not going to use any more of Kimari's lances that have elements, so I'm just going to go ahead and sell all of them. Yeah, I'll hold on to this one, just in case, the Night Lance. It's so good. It's so worth it. Makes me want to sell this one, though. The Hunter Spear. Strength plus 10, and this one has all those other strengths. Yeah, I'm never going to use it anyways, so fuck it. Or this one, really. I'm not going to use counterattack with him either. Just sell it. Why am I contemplating? Right now, we are just clearing inventory right now. We really are. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. Glorious Armlet. I'm going to hold on to that for now. Uh, same thing for Waka. I think I'm just going to go ahead and drop all of his things. Uh, maybe not yet. I will get rid of this. Water Strike. Two of those, sell one. I uh, know we're doing this. Why we're doing this now? I don't know. Just I just kind of felt like it all of a sudden. We won't need this switch hitter if we have the Ace Wizard. Get rid of the lit yellow arm guard. We'll get rid of this pearl arm guard. I'm not gonna use it. We're gonna get rid of anything that has strikes for <laughs> for Miss for Miss Lulu. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of the poison touch as well. She's never gonna use that. Sleep touch. Probably not that either. Yellow bangle, blue bangle. Uh, this one might be more useful. We can get rid of the white one though. Serene bangle, magic bangle. Hold on to. Um, do I really want to stop there? I kind of do. I'm sure there's more I can sell, like this yellow targ, this white targ. Is Dauntless. I don't think I'm ever going to use that one, the Shell Targe. SOS anything is kind of useless to me. And look at all this new shit I have down here. I haven't even looked at yet. Let's get rid of that one. Ogre Killer? Oh, wow. That actually sounds amazing. I might hold on to that one. Seeker Ring. Hot Knuckles. That. Metal Bracer. See ya. Ring. Goodbye. Flexible Arm. Amazing. Hold on to that. Switch hitter with three or two empty slots. I'll hold that on. Sorcery arm guard. And please hold on to that as well. Sorcery ring. I'm going to hold on to these MP plus ones. Water strike. I think I already had one of those. Two red armlets. We don't even need one. Hyper ball. Get rid of that. Red shield. Eh. Fireproof. That's not a bad idea. All right. I will be sure to all right, keep He's your brother in prayer. You, Thanks. Cool. And I forgot to go to buy Welcome. after I went to sell. Man, I just spent like seven minutes doing that shit. All right, I really want this booster cactuar for obvious reasons. Let's buy it and equip it. All right, now we're back down to like no money. And the only other thing I wanted to buy was actually this because it has alchemy. But goddamn, is it a lot of money? I feel like if I go too far, he won't be here anymore. Well, I have to hope that he doesn't go anywhere because I kind of really want that alchemy ability. I don't really remember what alchemy does, but I want it, and I will get it eventually. Whether I have to learn it later or not, I don't know, but I will get it. Also, I did not heal in two battles. That was beautifully done. Um, we actually don't need to kill the fucking grats at all. Let's just kill the, this big fucker over here. Actually, instead of this, I'm going to go Yuna. Fire, 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 hot like fire, hot like fire, and then for Auron, I'm going to bust out, uh, Lou, Lou to the Lou to the Lou, Lou, she's going to do a little bit more, fire, burn like fire, Bur oh, she's going to kill him, okay, I was just thinking, damn, with that new magic boost I just gave her, she's going to destroy, and she is going to destroy, um, but yeah, let's see. We wanna, we actually wanna run now, don't we? Whatever, just guard. Hopefully, I don't get confused. Don't confuse me, you bitch. Ah, 
this is going to be another 40 minute episode because I'm not going to end this till we get to the save point. We're pretty close to a save point, by the way, so I don't want to end the episode till we get to it. Right? We are pretty close to one, right? Yeah, we are. But there's an item I want to make sure we get, and I'm not sure how far down the path it is. I know we're getting close to it. We're getting close to that level 4 key sphere I've been promising. Okay, cool. At least we're getting battles of enemies I want to capture still, which is what I am only really going for at this point. Um, well, I'm going to let you go ahead and get rid of this little fucker. See ya. And then we'll let Aaron have a field day with this Nidhog over here. Yo, Nidhog. Back off. There we go. Over, kid. Good stuff. Good stuff, guys. Beautifully done. Alright. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Alright. There should be a path over here. Is the path. I see it already. Alright. Do we still have to catch an imp? We might. My will is strong. Let's get it. Let's get the imp real quick and then we'll run. Are we done with imps yet? Not yet. We might be now, but we weren't yet. I know we need to heal, but we're really close to the save point, so I'm not too concerned about it at the moment. Let's just go down. Oh, what the fuck you, camera. I hate the camera. I hate it. There's two treasure chests down here, and I want them both really badly. HP sphere. Awesome. And a motherfucking level 4 key sphere. I'm going to use that on Auron almost immediately. All right. One more imp to capture, or what? Let's see. One more imp. Still not done with imps, that's fine. Capture it and go. See you later, you grenade bitches. You grenada bitches. Alright, can we get to that save point already? I know we're close. Closing in on it. Oh, this battle's too easy to not run to just not run away, so let's just steal. Let's just do our normal stealing thing. Let's get Kimari in here. Doesn't hurt. No one hurt one bit. Get uh, so Riku. That's not Riku. That's Lulu. Riku, I need you. Thank you. Come again. All right. Fantastical. You know, I didn't actually think we we're gonna get across Mount Gagazette in one episode, but to be honest, we already are done with crossing the mountain for the most part. We still have another area to deal with after the mountain, of course, but. Before we get this Anakin, that is. But we're not going to do that in this episode, obviously. But at the very least, we can get to the save point here, which I know is not too far off, because I know there's no more treasures here. Um, I guess we'll just let Riku get a turn, because we're gonna, she's already in here. And we'll do that. And then we'll get Yuna in here real quick. And let Yuna do her thing with a little bit of burnage. Low burnage! Put your dukes up, homie. Put him up. I put him up. Put him up. Put him up. Put him up. He's only got 6k left, so put him up. Put him up. Put him up. Fuck, he killed Titus. That's not good. Can't even run even if I wanted to with Titus dead. Kamari didn't get a turn yet, did he? Alright, well, in that case, let's make Kamari get a turn. <laughs> I don't think it matters. Yuna. Alright, Yuna. Um, I really just want to get rid of this big dude first. Can you die? Ugh, so close. Fuck you and your counterattack. Yes, he, he's starting to counterattack, by the way. No, he's gonna confuse me, you son of a bitch. No, this is worst case scenario right now. If I die, I'm gonna be very sad. Don't kill me. Wake everyone up. This is very bad. Why did I bring Arn in? This is the worst idea I've ever had. Okay, at least Kimari hit himself. That's actually not the worst thing in the world. I'm just sad that it's Kimari because Kimari is so slow. No, he's confused again. Knock him out of his confusion, please. Yes, yes. Okay. Whew. All right. Um, Waka, I need you right now because I need you to get rid of... Actually, fuck. What am I gonna do? Um. Um. Shit. I'm. 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 I'll 
Okay, okay, okay. I got this. I just want to make sure I don't lose. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to bring out Kane. Bring him out. Bring him out. Here is Kane. Let me show you what he's about. <laughs> I know we're not going to capture this other fucking Yeti fool. Well, we still can. Actually, I definitely can. I probably still will. I'm just going to be careful with what I do here. This episode's hell long now, but uh, <laughs> I was just I just want to keep it in just in case I happen to lose there. Massive waste of time summoning Kane, but that's all right. That's all right. Call for a victory, baby. Call for a victory. Meteor strike. Booyah. Go ahead and psych yourself up, homie. Pretty sure confuse won't work, so go ahead and try. Try and confuse and amaze me with your plantical fantasticalness. I will burn you with my strike from the meteor. Fucker. Right, one down. Wow. That guy might actually defeat my Ifrit if I'm not careful. I'm gonna be a little bit careful here. One more of those knocks to the dome and I will die. I might have to heal, actually. In fact, I think I will, just because I'd rather him not die. Fuck! I don't have Fira! Ugh! Why? Why haven't I customized any of my Aeons yet? It's because I haven't really needed to. And I probably won't need to, at least not for a while. Definitely don't need it right now. Except for at this very moment when I needed Fira. Otherwise, we could. I could probably learn Fira real easily with him, too. I probably have plenty of fire gems or whatever the hell it's going to cost me. Um, I am going to kill him. Oh my god, he has 191. What the hell, man? Alright. I'm going to say goodbye to Kane. Bye, Kane. I just want to make sure I capture this guy because. You don't always come across these guys easily. Now Waka can shine. Do your 191 damage, bro. Wow. I can't believe I... That was just sloppy. Sloppy jalopy. Seriously. That was, that was absolutely horrid. I can't even believe I let that happen. Yuna, please cure everyone because they're a bunch of idiots who don't know what the fuck they're doing with their lives. Now she's out of MP. Great. We're getting close to that damn save point. I know we are. Oh, look, another one of these checkpoints. Uh, Alright, um... Um... We just want to capture this guy. You know what? Screw this. We're kicking it off with magic this time. Screw uh, this. Burn in hell, you son of a bitch! There we go. That was only like half his HP, though. And the unit doesn't have any more MP... I guess Kimari's gonna get a turn. Um, looks like Kimari just do regular Fira. Still should do a good amount of damage. At least a couple thousand, I would hope. Oh yeah, that's good. That was good, actually. Got him a turn and it did good damage. I can live with that. Aurin, there you go. Sea Cannon! I hate these fucking plants. I really, really do. If I could just get ten of these fucking other guys would be done with these guys and we wouldn't have to fight this battle anymore. See ya! Bashura! Alright. Probably should've used Waka so I could run away now, but uh, we're taking our chances. Just don't do it to Titus. Fuck you! <laughs> to Titus, seriously. Yes, they did it twice. That's good. That's very good. Alright. Happy joy joy I have in my soul's hole. All right, here's another little checkpoint. Let's see what the, she has to say about this one. All this way, only to fail. It must have been tough. Must have been. This is actually pretty far into the mountain. We're almost to the end here, actually. Now, is there another little side panel here? No, never mind. God damn it. <sighs> Am I done catching imps yet, by the way? I almost feel like I should put the first strike weapon back on Titus now but he's so it's so nice to have him be able to capture things so quickly I don't have to switch his weapon all the damn time but we're almost done capturing everything ten times almost we're obviously not done yet 
Titus over here. Get the hell out of this place. Run! I just want to get to the save point. I just want to get to the save point. I just want to get to the save point. I just want to. I just, just want to. I just want to. just, just want to. Another one of these fuckers, huh? Alright. Defend. Capture. Is that 10 yet? Alright, we're done with imps. No more of this battle. Yay. No more imps, no more grenades. Good, good, good. I'm happy. I'm happy. Alright. But, happy as I may be, we are now at the end of our journey across Mount Gagazette. We're at the save point. We're almost, okay, we're almost done with our journey across Mount Gagazette. Anyway, let's do some sphere level stuff before we end this episode. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and take Yamari down here. Then he can learn that magic spell, which is bio. And now, you know what I could do with all those level 3 key spheres I got? I could go down here and learn Nab Gill. What the hell is Nab Gill? I don't even know what that is. Sounds like something to steal Gill from enemies, but I don't think I want it. It doesn't sound really that interesting, to be perfectly honest. I don't know if that ability is actually in the original Final Fantasy X. I think that might only be in the PAL version. In fact, I'm fairly certain that that's the case. Um, anyway, now we need to get back over here. I think this is as far as I can go. Remember, we're backtracking right now with Titus. I want that extra strength. I want it. I want it badly. How does Lou have no sphere levels? We got that level 4 key sphere. Let's do that right now. I almost forgot about that. Let's get that zombie attack. Oh, yeah. Now we're talking. It's also worth it for this extra shit that's up here as well. This extra MP. And this extra magic. Both are nice. But we're also learning zombie attack, which is awesome. It's really not that amazing, but it is nice to have. Also, I'm thinking level 3 key sphere right here, baby. Oh, yeah. I am. I didn't even notice that that was there. But you know what? I'll take the extra agility. Hell yeah. Arn with extra agility is no joke. That's a scary proposition. Alright, let's get him over here. Get some more strength. Strength is good. Now that we've got Arn moved on a little bit, I'm excited because he got some more strength and stuff. I like it. And Riku with more agility? Damn, she's probably hella fast now. She's already pretty fast, but now she's hella fast. Damn, that was hella fast. Is this more magic for Yuna? Because, man, she's already better than Lulu. Now she's four points better than, even four more points better than Lulu. All right, I believe that's everybody's stuff for now. Let me heal. Why didn't I heal yet? Um, while I'm thinking about it, let's go to Kane. Sorry, I'm, I'm wigging out here. Abilities for Kane. I want to make sure he has fucking Fira. Where's Fira? Five bomb cores? Well worth it. Teach him Fira, please. Can he learn Firaga as well? Ooh, fire gems? Heck yes. Give him Firaga. Alright. Speaking of that kind of stuff, can we give Stratus Blizzaga? Might as well make my Aeons at least strong enough to use their own strong abilities. Ice gems? Do it. I'm not holding those gems for any other reason, to be perfectly honest. Um, Ixion, can we learn Thundaga? Oh, we can. Lightning gems, perfect. Beautiful. I don't know if he has Thundara, but he has Thundaga. He must have a Thundara, because I couldn't learn it. Um, yeah, I think I'm happy with that, actually. I'm good. Um, anything else I want to do? I know I'm, like, buying time now. Alright, anyway. Yeah, fuck it. One long episode. I was thinking about cutting this in half, but you know what? Fuck it. We're across Mount Gagazette. I'm a happy. I'm a happy camper. In the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X, we'll see what lies at the end of Mount Gagazette. More things, or somebody. Hmm. I mean, it's a dungeon. Will it culminate in a boss fight as usual? Guess we'll find out in the next episode. I'll see you guys then. Peace.